Yeah, uh, Riley Reed, by the way, was on No Jumper podcast. And she was talking about a time that David Dubrick was making her super uncomfortable, trying to push her to have sex with Dom. Uh, it's so f***ed up. It's actually so interesting. This just came out. And in the context of everything we when know about David him, it really speaks volumes. Let's take a look. Dobrik's YouTube video, he has a camera on me and he goes, do you think uh, my friend Dom is hot? And I was like, yeah, he's cute. He's like, would you kiss him? And I was like, yeah, I'd kiss him. He's like, would you kiss him right now? And I was like, oh, I'm under a little pressure. I'm in a room of like 12 people playing up this Riley Reed persona, filming this David Dobrik video. And he's like, would you fuck him? And I was like, yeah, again, playing up Riley Reed persona. And then he's like, would you fuck him right now? And I was like, uh, and then they were like, okay, like, let's go into the room. And they like, they basically like pushed me into a room with him. He starts like talking to me about wanting to do stuff and everything. And I was like, uh, and I asked him, I was like, when's the last time you were tested? And they were also talking about how he just had a, some like the night before or something. Right. And he was like, I haven't been tested in like three weeks or something. And I was like, well, I'm definitely not you. I felt so lucky that he didn't get tested because then I got to end the video on such a beautiful, positive note because I was True. like, guess what? He could have me if he was tested, but he's not. So make sure you get your. Shout out more pie, David by the way. Uh, get tested, folks. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's kind of interesting that even Riley Reed, who's like, you know, an empowered woman, independently wealthy, uh, felt so much pressure from David putting his camera in her face that she w she was, it sounds like, was going to be coerced into sleeping with Dom if he had a clean bill of health. Yeah. Knowing what we know now, that's horrifying. And considering how already open she is sexually by her own choice, the fact that he was able to make her uncomfortable in a situation like that speaks. Why volumes. does it also like, why does he, he, he treating like, because she does sex work, he treating her like, uh, almost subhuman in a way how it's like, he doesn't give her any heads up. It's just like, come over here and we'll put the camera in your face. Okay. Now you're going to have sex with Dom, right? Mm -hmm. That's what you do. Right. So you're going to go and have sex with my buddy. So nasty, dude. What a what a fucking freak that little dude is. Also, can you imagine that like energy shift from I'm in front of the camera, David's like laughing, and then the door closes, and it's just like oh. him being like so like let's go now. Yeah, and it's Dom's like, what like the what yeah, do you mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't even imagine. Dom's ready to talk shop because obviously he's a f R word is mm -hmm. too. So shout out to Riley Reed, who luckily got out of that situation. But yeah, people have been buzzing about this clip. We try to find the original upload on David's channel. Zach wasn't able to find it. We found this re-upload of the clip, though, on YouTube. Sounds like he scrubbed. Yeah. Also, uh, also the fact that this hasn't become like a bigger story. I feel like just because she's a porn star, it's not even taking taking very serious after. Well, the here's the here's the second or the most upvoted comment on this clip. With uh, I'm sure this is a tater tot. Does she not know how to say no? <laughs> this is like um, Keemstar logic. Like, how do you assault someone in the mouth? Remember that? Yeah, yeah. just close your mouth. Just close your mouth. According to Keem. Uh, dude, golly, man. You know, I went to Dom's channel to see if he posted anything in response, and his latest video from 23 hours ago is H3H3 exposed for cucking. <laughs> <laughs> it's, two, uh, it's two minutes and 28 seconds. Uh, should we watch it? I mean, I hate to even give him attention because he's so irrelevant. And I, he's obviously trying to bait me, but maybe it's fun, uh, entertaining anyway. I haven't vetted it. I could watch right now, or we could do it live. Let's do it live! Fuck it. Fuck it! Do it live! Yeah, this is really... You You make a great point, love. I mean, if this was anyone else, people would care, but... Yeah. Mm -hmm. they making the same assumption David did, which is that basically... Sh it's funny, she she has, like, almost no agency. She's just, like, a, like a inanimate sex object. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's weird. Does she not know how to say no? Boy, you are fucking dumb as hell. Did you watch the video? Like, if any woman is gonna be comfortable saying no it's gonna be her mm -hmm. though really it should tell you more about the coercion that men like david can can exert over women and not vice versa yeah and like how disorienting that experience probably was going yeah from dude room to room also david is like in this extreme power position you know what i mean what does he do then does he just sit in the living room and listen yeah that's his that's what he's into <laughs> you we know learned. what <laughs> That's weird. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he talked about 
one of his biggest fantasies would be watching his girl um, having sex with someone else. I did not. I, I remember that. I just, it being put into practice like that, it's weird. You know he had an ear to the door, or possibly a camera in there. I'm not even going to front. That dude had a camera and the fire alarm. Yeah. <laughs> you know he did. <laughs> He's fucked up like that. People still lining up for Dobrik's, though. By the way, speaking of lining up for Dobrik's, when are we getting some of that? I know some stuff about Dobrik's. I watched a review. They're not doing full pizzas yet. You got to pull that a little closer. They're not doing full pizzas yet. Just slices? Just slices. And a maximum of three pri uh, three per person. Mm -hmm. yeah. And the box that they what like. are they selling? Fucking Adderall or slices? <laughs> they David like went on this whole thing about how beautiful their circular box was with the branding. And it is beautiful. It's stunning. But that's not the box that they were giving people. I just want to taste it. Mm -hmm. uh, Sam went yesterday because um, we were using it for something in Silent Library today. And I told her to get some extra for us to review it. What? And yeah, it's the three slice maximum. She waited in line forever, and she could only buy three slices. Wait, we now. have a slice here? No, we had to we had to use it for for the segment today. Yeah, but there's three slices in the building right now. N not as the way you would imagine. They oh are. my god, you couldn't save me like one virgin <laughs> bite. Is there one virgin <laughs> bite? Sam, there's. Is there one there's virgin not. bite of Dilbert? Sorry. No. Oh, damn. <laughs> <It's cold>. No. <laughs> yeah. How was the experience of getting it, Sam? Uh, well, I had to wait in line forever. And sorry. Here, here, hold on. <laughs> oh, oh. I had to wait. Ian, are you trying to strangle her? For around 45 minutes or so. And they were only letting like three or four people in at a time. Um, and it's kind of set up like Sparrow. I think that's how you pronounce it. If you've ever been to like the Yeah, place like, the the mall, like the mall, mall pizza? Yeah. So you can, only get, you can only get three slices at a time. And um, it's just like whatever they have under the like warmer. The heat lamp. Time. What kind of, dude, three? What are you talking about? Three slices? That they barely tied one person. They don't have the pizza yeah. technology. What happens if you go with a friend? <laughs> Uh, I mean, then your friend can get three. Did it's you ask person. for more than three? And they're like, no. Um, well, I asked for a whole pizza, and they said they can only do three slices. Oh, my time. God. Pathetic. And then they also had ice cream. Mm -hmm. um, oh, there was this. Every, like, five minutes, the lights would go off, and they would play All I Want for Christmas, the Mariah Carey song. And there would be like strobes in a disco ball for oh. like ten seconds. Is that that's probably the coin gimmick thing where you put a coin in th and like the lights go on and off? Oh, really? I didn't yeah. know. Yeah, but that they say you get to do with the pie. But I was wondering oh. why it was happening so much, mm -hmm. but I didn't get a coin every five minutes. I knew that thing would be just. That's exhausting. It was, exhausting. It was yeah. extremely annoying. Mm -hmm. So yeah, but um, I did. So I had to cut. The pizza up for in a certain way for what I had to do with it today and I did take a little bite I must say okay go ahead and um, it was the ratio from crust to topping was like four to one not good Boo. the crust is like this thick and the, there's the thinnest layer of toppings on top well it is dough brick after all it's extremely uh -huh. dough. It's, it's all it dough feels no like brick. you're eating a loaf of bread <laughs> I'll so, throw no brain. Yeah. <laughs> Was there a back room in the pizza place where uh, people could hook up and David can peek Record through it. and watch? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, there was a kitchen that had yeah, a window. Kitchen. You could see Red into condo. the kitchen. So, Ooh, voyeur. You put a coin in and then you can go drink <laughs> off. And you can go David peak. will watch. Watch a peep show. Yeah. yeah. Was there a limit on ice cream? Uh, I don't know. Um, they just gave me two scoops. I don't know if there's a limit. Hmm. How was, was the flavor? Yeah. Dough, dough ratios were crazy, but how was the flavor? It was fine. It was really dry. Oh, the, the ice there, cream? I got a spicy vodka and oh. two meat lovers. And the meat lovers was fine. The spicy vodka, though, it was just, it was really dry. Unforgivable. Pathetic. Yeah. Hmm. Did they have honey on it? No, I didn't. I, I didn't see the one that had honey on Pathetic. it. I, I wonder if that hmm. was the pepperoni, but they were out of it when I was ordering. So I don't oh, know. Oh, interesting. Absolutely mm. pathetic. The ice cream was the worst part. It was horrible. I had to like do a palate cleanser to get the taste out of my mouth. Wait, tell me way. everything. It was, Why? It just tasted horrible. Was it soft serve or was it scoops? No, it was scoops. And I don't even know what the flavor was supposed to be. It's called Blue Moon and it was like baby blue. 
Oh. Um, Blue balls as David watches as his friends hook up in the <laughs> pe- in the back room of the pizza joint. Flavor. <laughs> Flavor. Flavor. That that is how I would describe it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Perfect. But David, no, I don't. I don't know what you're making a mockery be. of the Dobrik. Bottom line is, he cannot be trusted. He cannot be trusted with the pizza. How was the parking situation? The ratios are oh off. Oh my god, the parking was. There was Excuse no. Excuse me, I'm trying to do. <laughs> there's no respect. What were the facilities like? Uh, the restaurants no, there's, in Dobrik. Well, what I was got, the, Excuse me. What was the? Oh, oh, excuse me, please. Did they have a public bathroom? Yeah, was um, it open to public, or you I, need like? I, you, I know y'all don't, like don't care if there's a public Excuse bathroom me, at Dobrix. Excuse know, me, actually. sir. I know y'all don't care about that. Excuse me. It's a, what are you? He I'm disrespected curious. the Italian people. My kids are seven percent Italian, Dan. This is actually an important issue to me, and I don't appreciate y'all trying to make a parody Wait, out of this. Isn't Ella seven percent? She's fifteen percent, Dan. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Don't fucking step to me. <laughs> My kids are Italian. Have Italian heritage. This is important. Mm. That's what I do. You know, you've been calling people fascists a lot lately. You know who is Italian? Benito Mussolini. Okay, so what? So I'm just what, saying. My kids are fascists? Whatever, bro. How did, 7%. How did, Aiden, how did Aiden Ross pronounce it? Like, he fucking really fucked his fascist. name up. Yeah. You fascist. As I was saying. <laughs> did they have uh, tiles on the floor or was it concrete? <laughs> you don't care about if there's tiles the or carpeted. concrete. Was there carpet? Think, was Why, the brick how is that relevant at all? Was the brick exposed on the building where yeah, the oh, graffiti see? was? A dope brick. So, Dude, yeah, it, it, you guys are point. asking ridiculous questions. Stop. Was there a parking enforcement parked in front? Oh my God, no, dude. I actually had to park at Saddle Ranch, and I had to yeah. tell them I was. Bro. Like, I was like, I'm going to pick up a Uber Eats order, <laughs> <laughs> and I just went, and I was gone for 45 minutes, but I didn't say anything. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> David Dombrik is disrespecting the Italian people. A three to one ratio is, it's Italiophobia. Do you think he pays Mariah Carey residuals? Mm, for every five minutes, he should be. It does, guys. That's so. just irrelevant. He has no pizza. Experience. She is the queen of. He Christmas. doesn't have pizza experience. He comes to me. He sells three slices. What is this? What is this? The Great Depression? Is this post World War One? Famine. We have plenty. My friend, if I come to your pizza place, let me get a pie. Cannot be trusted. You cannot be trusted. 